Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City, 2021, directed by Johannes Roberts, is a reboot of the popular video game franchise. The film attempts to blend the plot lines of the first two games, focusing on the origins of the T-virus outbreak in the doomed city of Raccoon City. Starring Kaya Scodelario as Claire Redfield, Robbie Amell as Chris Redfield, and Hannah John Kamen as Jill Valentine, the film aims to capture the horror and survival elements of its source material. On the positive side, Welcome to Raccoon City does a commendable job of creating a dark and atmospheric setting reminiscent of the games. The attention to detail in recreating iconic locations like the Spencer Mansion and the Raccoon City Police Department will please fans. The film's use of practical effects and makeup for the zombies and monsters adds a layer of authenticity and horror that is often lost in heavy CGI usage. Kaya Scodelario and Robbie Amell deliver solid performances, capturing the essence of their characters and providing a sense of urgency and determination. The film's pacing is brisk, with a constant sense of impending doom that keeps the audience engaged. The storyline stays relatively faithful to the original games, which will be appreciated by longtime fans of the series. However, Welcome to Raccoon City struggles with its dialogue and character development. The script is often clunky, with lines that feel forced and unnatural, detracting from the overall experience. The film's attempt to juggle multiple plot lines and characters leads to a lack of depth for many of the key players, making it difficult for the audience to form a strong connection with them. The film also suffers from a lack of originality, heavily relying on fan service and callbacks to the games, rather than developing its own unique story. This can make the film feel more like a series of Easter eggs rather than a cohesive narrative. The limited runtime also means that some plot points are rushed, leaving little room for tension to build. In addition, the film's action sequences, while entertaining, lack the polish and intensity of other modern horror films. Some scenes come across as predictable and formulaic, diminishing the overall impact of the horror elements. In conclusion, Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City is a mixed bag. It succeeds in creating a faithful and atmospheric adaptation of the beloved video games with solid performances and practical effects. However, the film's weak dialogue, underdeveloped characters, and reliance on nostalgia prevent it from standing out as a memorable horror film. Fans of the games will find much to appreciate, but casual viewers may find it lacking in depth and originality.